Hello, you beautiful stars. So good to see you. I almost forgot to do an energy update. I'm actually still semi-recovering from the weekend. Um, the full moon was glorious and wonderful, but surrounding <laughs> energy, let's say, was rough. It was very rough and on certain signs, it was very rough. So I feel you, I do. Um, I also, my sleep is way messed up, which we've talked about going into August. We've talked about this repeatedly that a lot of people's sleep gets messed up. But now because of the whole lucid kind of time shifting stuff we're going into, the whole be more with the flow, don't fight against it, right? Be more like water than a rock. <laughs> yeah, we have to become much more flexible which I will say, all of my signs are pretty much fixed. It's not so easy for me. I hope you all are doing much um, a better job of it than I am. The past few days and even going into like the 17th or so, it should start breaking up before then or after then. Guys, I really want you to know, you know, I've been talking a lot about how August is very much going to be ego, ego, ego. Well, in those moments, there's also a lot of truth. There is. Um, I had to stand up for myself in Stars of the Morning and Light a lot this past weekend, and I will do that. Um, others have had to do the same sort of thing stand up for themselves or what they believe in. And this is not in judgment to others. This is not to stake our claim and we are right and you are wrong. That's not it. It's to really, truly identify and speak who we are, what, we're, what we believe in and what our cares are. That's, that's it guys. Because right now we are in that we are claiming ourselves. We are claiming, claiming, claiming ourselves. And when we speak it, we manifest it. And all this ego pushing back and forth, pushing back and forth, it's so we can release judgment of others for they know not what they do. But it's also so we can claim what is truly ours and what we truly believe and feel and think and I will say, ladies and gentlemen, normally, let's say we get very heated inside or we feel like we have to say something, that passion is very close to what our soul's purpose is. Very close. You all might have topics out there that get you all heated up. And for me, it's like, okay, whatever, because it's not my soul's passion. It's not my soul's purpose. And then there's stuff that, comes my way that everybody else is like oh court don't worry about that and I'm like oh no I'm gonna worry about that <laughs> right so it's calling to us so let's pay attention to what we feel like we need to say on top of trying to be as flexible as we can with the change remember we've been talking about the waters and neutrality that we've been talking about 5d we've been talking about releasing the judgment we've been talking about all this stuff now it's time to practice 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 i love you all and i claim stars of the morning light i claim its prosperity i claim its protection i claim that it is truth knowledge and justice for all at stars of the morning light so that is what i do I love you all so much. I will see you tomorrow for um, our little reading that we started about time. It might be an interesting concept to discuss. All right. Bye, loves.